Welcome to my all new Blu-ray review. Today I am taking a look at a box set from Screen Factory. Today I will be taking a look at the Critters box set from Screen Factory. Uh, I am a huge fan of the Critters franchise. I remember watching parts one and three when I was really little because a little mom and pop video shop only had uh, Critters 1 and 3. It wasn't so much later that I saw Critters 2 and 4, and I loved both of them. I love them all for different reasons. 3 and 4 are not that great. Critters 1 and 2 are just awesome. But uh, I still enjoy them for nefarious reasons. Or different reasons. Uh, but uh, yeah, so let's take a look at this box set. It's another hard box from Scream Factory, which is really nice because I hated the It's Alive box set. It was like paper, and uh, it's got this awesome cover art with the critters. Like a critter here, critter here, critter here, critter here. Critters everywhere, covering the box. It's a really nice looking box, and uh, yeah. We also get this side copyrights on the bottom and the top. Don't forget the back with these ginormous teeth that belong to such a tiny creature. We got the plots for the films and uh, yeah so now let's pull out the discs. Box over here. We've got critters. They bite. And this is a classic B-movie. <laughs> I really enjoy it. And uh, it's got some nice special features here. This is right here with uh, the browns and the both images. It's the last name of the family that's attacked in the film. I love this artwork. It's the original poster art. On the inside, we get the original artwork, the, actually the DVD artwork that comes, well it's actually poster art, now that I think about it, it's on the reversible sleeve. The special features include a new 2K scan from the original film elements, new They Bite, the making of Gremlin, the making, Gremlins, the making of Critters, featuring interviews with actors D. Wallace, Scott Grimes, Don Opper, Terrence Mann, and Lynn Shea. It's produced by Barry Opper, who was the driving force of the Critters franchise. Uh, Critters, uh, it's also produced by Critters designers Charles Cheeto, Edward she Cheeto, is it Cheeto or Chido? I don't know. They did Killer Clowns from Outer Space, and Steven Cheeto, and more. A new four- for Brian, a tribute to screenwriter Dominic Murr, Brian, an alternate ending, theatrical trailer, TV spots, and a still gallery. Really nice, really nice. These are all PG-13 rated, uh, friendly-ish films. They have some darkness to them, which I like. Uh, and Siskel and Ever Everett and Siskel and Ebert actually gave this two thumbs up, which is really cool. I didn't know that. <clears throat> now we're on to my favorite cover of the bunch, which belongs to Critters 2, the main cores. Uh, they're back for a second. <clears throat> Go spying, which I didn't show you on the first one. This is the first one spying. Here's the second one spying the back with the love interest and the grandma brown uh, it's everyone's turn for seconds I love that because you get, get at the uh, critter ball is turning while it's on its way to get to some seconds uh, that's really funny special features include a new 2k scan from the original film elements a new the main course the making of critters two features including Interviews with actors Scott Grimes, Leanne Curtis, 
Don Opper, Terrence Mann, and Lynn Shea, director Mick Garris, critters designer Charles Chiato, Edward Chiato, and Stephen Chiato. Chiotto, isn't that it? Chiotto? Yeah, it's Chiotto, my bad. Behind the scenes footage, theatrical trailer, TV spot, and still gallery. Nice. Now this is the only one that I that I didn't flip the cover around because this is what I saw when I was a kid on the VHS tape that I have. Critters 3. You are what they eat. This is a really nice Blu-ray. Arrow in the head says Leonardo DiCaprio gives another good performance in this ravenously fun sequel. It's an okay sequel. It's got the same body count as the first, only two deaths. So, two human deaths. And, um, the special features are new You Are What They Eat, The Making of Critters 3, featuring interviews with the producer Ger Barry Opper, screenwriter David J. Chow, or Chow, stars Don Opper and Terrence Mann, Critters designer Charles Chiotto, Edward Chiotto, and Stephen Chiotto, and more. A trailer and still gallery. Nice. I love this cover with a city in the background. It's really cool. And finally, we have Critters 4. They are invading your space. Or they're invading your space. They returned home to outer space. By this time, a lot of number fours and franchises went to outer space. Like Leprechaun and uh, Pinhead. This is a really cool cover. The uh, cover for the fourth one on the inside doesn't look that great. It's pretty much the same cover as part three, but just in space. So that's why I chose this one, because it's the one I saw as a kid. Really happy to have that. I like the other cover where they're on the moon and shit. It's pretty cool, too. For special features, we have a new Space Madness, The Making of Critters 4, featuring interviews with... Producer Barry Opper, screenwriter David J. Shao, stars Don Opper and Terrence Mann. Critters designers Charles Chiotto, Edward Chiotto, and Stephen Chiotto. A trailer and a still gallery. So, uh, not that much, but still, I want to see the making of Critters 4 because all the Critters were really cool. And I wish they made more than four. So, uh, yeah, that's the Critters Franchise box set. Awesome sauce. Lion Brian Gatto, host of Horror Show Entertainment. Make sure to like my Twitter and Facebook fan page is in the description below. Leave comments and subscribe.